to be back in Big Sky Country. Vice President Mike Pence back in Montana pitching Senator Steve Daines and other Republicans running for office. Good evening, everyone. Thanks for joining us on your Monday. I'm Janelle Slade. Well, from promoting Montana candidates and President Donald Trump to putting down Joe Biden and professing to defund Planned Parenthood, the vice president spoke to a crowd in Bozeman today. Q2's Russ Riesinger is standing by now with more on his speech. Russ. Well, Janelle, Montana getting a lot of attention in this coming election as Republicans try to hang on to both the seat in the Senate as well as Montana's only seat in the House. Vice President Mike Pence here to stump for them, but he spent a lot of time talking about his boss. But I'm here because Montana and America need four more years of President Donald Trump in the White House. Now, the vice president was joined on the stage by A.J. Not Afraid, the chairman of the Crow tribe who endorsed the Republicans who are running, including President Trump. Pence said the road to victory runs right through Montana as he rallied that partisan crowd, making a pitch for Steve Daines, Matt Rosendale, and Greg Gianforte. President Trump, of course, won Montana easily, and Pence played up the job he's done, saying the president has cut taxes, rolled back regulations, and stood for the sanctity of human life. He also praised the job the president has done when it comes to the coronavirus. In our first three years, more Americans were working than ever before. In a word, we made America great again. And then the coronavirus struck from China. But the people of Montana deserve to know that before the first documented case of community spread, happened in the United States. President Trump took action that no other American president had ever taken when he suspended all travel from China. The vice president, as you might expect, also took quite a few shots at Democratic presidential candidate Joe Biden, trying to portray him and both, uh, both him and Montana governor, uh, Steve Bullock is being what Pence called with the radical left. With the Senate race expected to be very close, it wouldn't be surprising to see either Pence or even the president himself make a trip here before the election. Janelle? All right, thanks so much, Russ. Well, MTN's Gabby Krevitt was at the rally today with several hundred people, and she brings us more from there. Things are just wrapping up here in Belgrade, where Vice President Mike Pence just came to rally on behalf of President Donald Trump, as well as Montana Republicans running for office. The Vice President spoke on everything from protecting the Second Amendment to supporting law enforcement across the country. I was just told there was around 700 people that attended the event. Many people on social media were asking, were people wearing masks? We would guess roughly between 10 to 15 percent of people in the crowd were wearing masks. And later tonight, we will have the full story on the rally, including an exclusive interview with Mike Pence, the vice president. For now, reporting here in Bozeman, Gabby Krevitt, back to you. All right, thanks so much, Gabby.